Greetings and welcome back to Smartwatch Ticks. We're a YouTube channel on the web at smartwatchticks.com. We are back with Wellu. Yep, go wellu.com to show you some brand new updated products that they have created. You may remember this one. We reviewed this as the Visual Beat a little while ago. It's a super simple little device that you simply touch to activate, lights up, it will monitor your heart rate and you can wear it on your chest to get a really cool ECG and monitor continuous heart rate. But things have changed. This has now migrated in two different directions and I'm about to show you that. This is this device exactly changed into a strap-free heart rate monitor. No strap anymore. You, you hook on these little pads and the pads can go on your body and a huge price reduction, 69 bucks basically. However, I've got a special coupon discount for you. That's right. GoWellU.com gets you in the door. You get 15% off anything you buy. Now, if that doesn't work, I'll show you an actual coupon you can type in later, but it should automatically take 15% off of every product I'm going to show you. GoWellU.com. That's all you got to do. Okay, so this, which was the Visual Beat, is now this portable ECG monitor that sticks on with these pads. They took the product and moved it also in a different direction. Oh, by the way, on this one, what it'll do is it'll monitor your heart rate. Your heart rate for up to 24 hours per session, 10 sessions in every 30 hours. That's for heart rate. But it does do EKG, which is ECG. It's the same thing. And here you're seeing a live one happening. This device will make a chart similar to this one that's showing you ECG here, your heart rate there, and it'll manually record. You have to hit the record button, but it can manually record and save in the app um, an ECG from 30 seconds up to 30 minutes for each session. This gets important because it's a big distinction in the products I'm about to show you. They also took this and went in a different direction. This is a similar type of device. See how small it is. It's integrated for touching in your hands. Instead of having snap-on spots, it's got little round buttons you'll see in the next picture. And it easily fits in a chest strap. And it's a little bit more, $89. Again, 15% off, GoWellU.com. This is a closer up picture of it, and this is showing you the type of charts that it produces. A little bit different than this. Handheld, you can do a lead one, lead two, or chest lead, which are three different ways of doing it. Touching both of these with opposite hands is a lead one. Lead two is touching one side and holding the other against your leg. Okay, you can get 30 seconds to 15 minute recording duration of your ECG charts in the app and you can share a PDF with your doctor. And again, it's not all that pricey, $89 for that one. But it's basic just to give you both of these, just give you some insight into how you're doing in little windows of information. Now, take that to a whole new level. Use a device that's basically the same as this, but it's in black now instead of white. And add a full-on 24-hour ECG recording component that can transfer over your entire ECG chart over that full day to a computer. And then have it scanned with AI analysis to assess what happened at any point in time while you were asleep, while you were eating, while you were... Well, whatever you happen to be doing and produce a detailed report, a full ECG report with all kinds of information. Wow. And that's something you can present to your doctor, your cardiologist, a digest for yourself, make uh, daily modifications to your diet or exercise plan. And of course, you get over 100,000 beats in a 24-hour period of each and every one of your uh, heart cycles. Incredible. Now, what does it look like? Well, 
I have it on, so I can't show you. In fact, I am at 22 and a half hours of my first 24 hours. Um, I'm wearing it, and that's what you're seeing live right here, live. I hardly used any battery on it, um, and I'll give you all the information coming up as soon as I'm done with it and integrate it into the computer analysis. But I do have an unboxing that I did yesterday of this unit, so let's pick up from there. Oh, you know what? I think it lifts. Yep, there we go. <laughs> you can see I haven't opened it yet. Uh, we get the manual in here. We get the device itself, which looks surprisingly like the one that we uh, used to clip on for the personal use, but this is set up for a much more extended uh, uh, long-term use. Please charge and activate it before first use. We will be doing that. Pop into here, we get a box that has some goodies in it. Now, before I show you the goodies, I want to show you this. There are, I got a whole bunch of stuff to show you. We'll start with this one. There are two different wearing methods for this device. You can uh, wear it with electrode patches that has strong anti-interference ability and signal acquisition, they say. Wearing with the chest strap is an alternative which can be used for uh, a long time and save cost. So if you're going to do it on your chest, you're going to be doing it at an angle like this. And if you're doing it uh, with the belt, you put it right here. And there's some information about how to do it. I say that because when we get in here, these things will start to make sense. This is cool. You've got the belt, okay? You have a bag full of these snap-on suction cup or adhesive cup type things. These here, and you can always buy more if you want to attach it to your body. So two ways of wearing it. The charging dongle, which is really easy to use. You'll take this and... Basically, you clip it on the end of the device. We'll get into that, charge it up, and you got it ready to go. So you could probably do that in the morning when you're taking your shower. And this fun little thing is a thumb drive they ship you as well with the software that you can put on your PC that you can generate amazing uh, charts, full ECG charts out of this. So let's get into it. Let's, let's open it up. We take that off, show you the unit itself. Yeah, it's, it's just like the other one, only in black. Now, I'm pretty sure it's through these that this, with the pins here, will connect and be able to not only charge the unit, but hopefully transfer the data over to your PC as well. Awesome, awesome stuff. Well, let's verify a little bit of that with a look at the manual. We always love to do that. It might be the only place you see it, although I would imagine well, you probably has a PDF of this up online, but in case they don't, or you just want to come back and quickly see what's in the manual, um, here it is, and you can freeze frame it at any time. So I'm not going to give you long enough to actually sit and read it, but uh, at least freeze frame it. All in English. Starting and stopping recording and installing the ECG browser to your PC. Then you got to register. You do need to set up an account on here and register it. And you do an analysis. Now your first time, um, you're going to plug it in. And you can't create a new user until you plug it in and it has some data to download. And then it's going to ask you first to create a new user. And after that, it'll download continuously to that user unless you want a different user and you can set up another user for the device as well. And one important thing to point out, what you're about to see, all of this analysis, all of this uh, computer work is absolutely free. You're not having to pay a penny for anything else that you're about to see. It's all included for the fee. There you go. So going into more detail about this, first of all, if you're ready to get it, Go well you. That's all you got to do. GoWellU.com. I got a special code set up for any product at all from WellU. 15% uh, off or as many as you want to buy at once. Discount coupon uh, and the GoWellU.com uh, will get you right to their website. You're going to get the WellU ECG recorder with AI analysis. Okay, it's an intelligent recorder with a 24 hour heart care. They give you some information on it. I'm going to go over it with you here. 
You're going to have, uh, for regular checkups, routine ECGs take just a few minutes, uh, and that makes it difficult to detect heart problems if they are spontaneous, happen at different times. The Will You Heart Health Monitor can continuously monitor for 24 hours, recording, get this, up to 100,000 ECG. And ECG EKG is just German for electrocardiogram, so same thing. It'll, up to 100,000 of those signals, yeah. You can uh, intelligently identify various arrhythmia risks and improve the detection rate for AFib and other symptoms. Again, this is not for diagnosis and treatment, but for recognition and advice to get to your medical professional or your cardiologist. It can lower the risk of a heart attack if you catch these things early. It can store 10 ECG recordings, 30 hours total, okay? <laughs> That's amazing. Each ECG re uh, recording can be up to 20, uh, can uh, be, re can record for up to 24 hours. The pacemaker, uh, if you have one, will affect ECG measurements. So don't use it with the pacemaker at the same time. Definitely consult with a medical professional on that. Now, this is for getting the data. Once you've got it, this is where this kicks in. You can get an instant ECG report at home. And it relies on an artificial intelligence enabled ECG algorithm based on 300,000 patients. Yeah, they've been using this for a few years now and collecting data with 50 million learning data fragments to analyze data and generate reports. The AI just looks at your heart wave and compares it on the fly with all of those analyses, kind of like how you'd know you'd search through a database for face recognition, but this is heart recognition of symptoms that could possibly be important for you to check out. It can intelligently look at 16 different categories. I don't really want to use the word diagnose because only a medical doctor, especially in the United States, can diagnose. But it can assess and advise in 16 different categories more than 104 kinds of potential abnormal ECG events. Just download the software, connect the device to the computer to view the waveform, and it will then an analyze the waveform and generate a report for you. And you're going to see that here. Um, the free software, you can check the detailed ECG waveform and report, including overview, supraventricular rhythm. There's eight of those possible variations. Ventricular rhythm, eight more. Heart rate variability, got 10 items on that. ECG report conclusions and an hourly statistics table of ECG data. So you can wear it while you're asleep, while you're eating, while you're exercising, while you're watching TV, while you're sitting watching Mr. Ticks for over an hour. You can see how beautiful your heart looks, right? <laughs> anyway. Notice, I wanted to add this to it. It's normal for each measurement result to be different, of course, due to the sporadic and transient nature of ECG events. So it is recommended to increase the frequency of monitoring and capture uh, incidents on time. The results of the ECG report are only for reference in daily heart health monitoring. They cannot replace the medical diagnosis results and cannot be used for clinical diagnosis and treatment. Use them, however, for your education and uh, advice to your medical professional because you can now take a 24-hour ECG at home. All right, I'm going to charge it up and we'll play with it. Okay, here we go. I transferred the program off of the thumb drive into my Lenovo. You know why I like Lenovo computers? Not because of the screaming processors or the vibrant colors. It's because when you go to brightness and you turn the brightness down, it's the only computer I've found that'll turn the screen completely off. At night when I'm laying on the sofa watching TV, all the others will go down to about there. But Lenovo's go all the way off. I love it. Absolutely love it. Thank you, Lenovo. Hi, I can see myself in the very bottom reflection of the computer. Are we ready? Okay, so this is the power charging dongle plugged into the USB port. I am still strapped in. I am between 23 and 24 hours now, and I'm getting heart rate, ECG, all of that. I'm going to take it off. Here I go. Yeah, I'm not going to show you this part. I've got the strap on. Mm, mm. 
Mm, yeah. Whoa, that's a biggie. Okay, there it is, sitting on the strap. See how wet my body is. It's always good to have moisture between you and the electrodes. And you can see on the strap where the electrodes actually are. There they are rubbery kind of thing and boy does it work well so we have to take the device off of here you'll notice now that the uh, chart is stopped over here the side with the connectors is going to go in here we're done with this one now and we are plugged into the computer everything's mounting select what happens well i think i'm going to select what happens by doing this download data what I had to do, it wasn't actually connected solidly. I made sure I jiggled it and got it connected. It asked me to uh, put in a new user, which I created. And now I have the different uh, data IDs, my username. I've used their default uh, age and gender information. Look at this, 11 hours and 40 minutes. That's the main one here. Um, I've got some other short ones that were test ones that I put in there first. We're going to select this one, view ECG. There's the ECG chart. Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay. Page one of 701 pages? Really? Okay, now I'm seeing how it goes. Well, let's just save this puppy as a PDF. Save. So it's in the act of printing to a PDF now. And uh, like I said, I got 700 pages of chart here. But more importantly is if we analyze what we just recorded, right? So I'm going to hit Analyze. Are you sure you want to analyze this data? Yep, 11 hours worth. It's sending it off somewhere. And in a little while, hopefully we'll have some analysis. Here we are. Okay, I've repositioned the computer and zoomed in a little bit for ease of use. Uh, we're in Chrome and it's a PDF being viewed directly in Chrome. And this is what we've got, uh, the basic information, the recording time. Now, I did it for 23 hours plus. This is 11 hours out of it. So the first thing I'd say is wearing it with a strap at night, rolling over, might... I remember one time I felt it go brrr, vibrate, which is what happens when it's turned on. So it might have disconnected long enough to turn off and then turn back on again when it touched my body when I rolled over. And I may have other reports in there from that. So might be better to actually use the adhesive patches and stick it on if you're going to go overnight. Just my first reading on this. So what have we got? Total number of heartbeats, 52,000. Mm. Wow, I got up to 166. And that happened at 3 in the afternoon. Oh, yeah. I had to go out and do some yard work down the steep driveway and back up again. I could see it popping up a little bit. But wow. Okay. Um, minimum happened at uh, just before midnight-ish. Heart rate averages 80. Now, we get into the RR interval, which should be over 1.5 seconds. And it's 4. Number of long intervals, number of, I don't know what I'm looking at anymore. Okay, the longest thing happened there. Here's my supraventricular rhythm information. My ventricular rhythm. Okay. You guys that are in the sciences and medicine may know what all this is about. Uh, it's seven pages worth of stuff. And it doesn't look like I've got any data in here related to all of this. Um, maybe that's a good thing, right? Wow, hourly statistics table. Let me hold the edge here so it doesn't vibrate too much. Wow, ventricular, atrial, yeah, heart rates, all broken down by time. There's the chart. Overall minimum heart rate, overall maximum. So it found a segment. That's probably that 166 beat thing that was going on. And that's what it looked like. And there's nice and relaxed. Wow, I'm impressed with this. Okay, how do you say that? Anyway, there's that chart. 
pack premature supraventricular contractions couplet of pack yeah this is not for the lay person however uh it's very detailed information this is usually noise and i'm hoping it's filtering all that out but it's done a an artificial analysis that's page seven of this entire uh segment of 11 plus hours worth of of wearing this thing during the day and into the evening and generated this report which is a pdf that i could print or i could send out to somebody awesome so once again there's two different wearing methods with this device i had this one with the band set up this is the alternative and uh, if you're willing to put this patch thing on if you're doing an extended one this seems to me like it's going to work better uh, not be as subjected to movement and erratic uh, signals and of course easier at night if you're rolling over what do we got here then look at that little thing this is amazing science in here it's able to store all of those heartbeats and we're not just talking counting beats you saw the detail of the chart continuous 24 hours worth that you can then transfer to an app in a pc a program and um have it analyzed uh, with a complete report out of it as well. Very, very fascinating device. Um, it's called an ECG recorder with AI analysis. It's about $350, but remember, use the link GoWellU.com. That should get you in the door to get 15% off of this or any other product that they've got. GoWellU.com. And one last thing, if you're not into... Uh, these strap onable kind of things but would rather have something simple like this that you can just put in your hand turn it on and watch a tv screen for your ecg they've got this puppy too touch here touch here touch my hand it's called a personal ekg monitor and if i stay still long enough there you go you see i'm getting an ecg on here and in the lower right hand corner it's going to pop up what my heart rate is based on the ecg chart at the moment does it for 30 seconds saves it in memory you can transfer it to the app you can look at those 30 second segments and do whatever you like email them out whatever a really nice clean and easy way for about 120 dollars to get into this and you can plug in here some external uh, snap things and you can of course stick it on your body as well and run it i think for up to 15 minutes anyway that's available to all of this coming to you from wellu.com here we go <laughs> we really appreciate it when you use our links because it lets them know that you visited us here and that you heard about us through here and that incentivizes these guys to continue sending new products like what you just saw and believe me they've got some creative things in the works right now so come on back register subscribe and we'll see you again soon thanks for watching gang